This morning, Florida Senator Marco Rubio, the once rival who in 2016 trumped up Lil Marco. And the first thing he does is launch an attack about some little guy thing because he doesn't have answers. Is set to become the president-elect's right-hand man on foreign policy as Secretary of State. Rubio turned into one of Trump's most vocal supporters on the campaign trail. Because together with Donald Trump, we are going to make America not just great, but greater than it has ever been before. He has extensive foreign policy experience in the Senate. On Ukraine, Rubio has recently been critical of the U.S.'s support. He voted against a supplemental funding bill passed earlier this year, urging for negotiations to end the war. Other Trump appointments, Florida Congressman Mike Waltz as National Security Advisor, the first Green Beret to serve in Congress, and former New York Congressman Lee Zeldin, set to lead the EPA. It comes as former Democrat-turned-Trump supporter Robert F. Kennedy Jr. is reportedly reviewing resumes for top jobs at the Department of Health and Human Services and the FDA. Kennedy, a vaccine skeptic, has indicated he would fire up to 600 employees at the National Institutes of Health, the agency responsible for keeping the nation safe from deadly diseases. Also weighing in on new hires, billionaire Elon Musk. Sources tell ABC News Musk has been on at least two phone calls Trump has had with foreign leaders and that Musk is now offering input on staffing decisions. Republicans have already locked in the Senate majority with one race still undecided. Control of the House of Representatives is still up for grabs. Christiane Cordero, ABC News, Washington.